Welcome to the text tutorial for Glogster EDU Basic. In just a minute or two, you'll be able to add text to your Glog, um, just like on my Glog where it says my favorites. There are a lot of different choices for text in order to customize your Glog. Your first step is to click text on your toolbar. And you have several different options for text. You have bubbles, titles, and stickers. Um, bubbles are like speech bubbles or thought bubbles. Stickers are for bodies of text if you have several lines you'd like to use. And titles are more for headings like my favorites um, or just a few words. I'm going to show you today an example of bubbles. And I click simply on bubbles just to see the bubble option. Um, you have different categories. You can also scroll along the bottom to find what you need. I'm going to choose this bubble here. And once you found what you'd like, it'll show up in the preview screen and you click use it. That'll actually put it onto your blog. You can click out um, and work and edit just with the speech bubble that you're using um, or thought bubble. You can drag it, move it around where you'd like it to put it. I'm going to have it coming out of this little penguin's mouth. And I have some options. I can click on it and rotate it um, so that it is positioned where I'd like. I also have the editing toolbar. Um, you can try that, see what different options you like. Most importantly in the text option, you'll want to click edit. And this is where you can actually do your typing. Um, you want to highlight what's there and you can delete it. And then the little AB1 option says edit text, edit font, edit color. And this is the option for what font you'd like to use. One of my favorite is this one. So you find what you'd like to use. Um, you can also change the color if you like, and you can type in your text box. Um, when you're done, you click Apply, and that will keep it there for you. You also have the option to um, use different characters if you'd like. Also, if you'd like to change the background of the bubble you chose, you can click on the little rainbow icon. When you click here, you can change the background to see what matches what you already have. I'm going to use another blue, like my page wall. When you find what you like, you click Apply, and the Apply button will um, keep it for you. Click OK again, and again, there are other options here if you'd like. You can make it a link. You can um, add effects. When you're done, you can click OK. It'll take you back out to your blog. Um, that's it. As always, if you want to save your changes, you click Save and Publish, um, and you're ready to add some more images or text boxes to your blog. Check YouTube for other tutorials for Glogster EDU Basic.